Alright, how are you doing? So I thought I'd do a really quick video here. I've been getting a lot of questions asking me about my home recording setup. So I thought I'd do a quick video trying to help some of you out there who've got some questions and who are looking to do the same thing as what I'm doing. Um, there's a, a little bit of confusion but there really shouldn't be. It's it's really really simple and uh, pretty, you know, quite cheap to set up and get yourself going so hopefully I can help you out here. So if you're not familiar with my videos I record my guitar tones um, and videos with a Fractal Audio Axe 8 so this will apply to things like your Line 6 Helix and your Headrush pedal boards or anything digital like that. Um, so let's get started so basically I have an Axe 8 down here at my feet and so what's happening here is I'm coming out of the back of the Axe 8 in stereo two XLRs and that is then going into a Focusrite Scarlett a great little unit nice and cheap and um, really simple straightforward to set up this is the 2i2 you can get more input if you wish um, but this is okay for me for what I need just two inputs left and right and um, simply just come out of the back of the USB cable into your PC or your laptop or whatever you have install the drivers and you're pretty much good to go from there then from there all you're going to need is a piece of software and um, I was using Pro Tools but me and Pro Tools don't really get on so I prefer to use Adobe Audition um, I've been using this for years I'm really familiar with it and that is what I prefer to use um, monitor wise I would recommend these really cheap but great monitors. They are the Tannoy Reveal 402s. Really cheap, but really good. Um, nice and small, compact. Uh, you know, if you're just in a small room like this, they're perfectly fine. You don't need anything bigger. They're plenty loud. You can also watch you know, your films, your movies, your, your TV shows, whatever. And they're also great for that. Just one set up out the back there and either side of the desk. Again, nice and cheap, really good. They do tend to flub out a little bit if you drive them too hard. But like I say, if you're just wanting, you know, a nice little cheap, small setup, I would recommend the Tannoy Reveal monitors. I've got a Surface Pro 4 here, and all that is doing is controlling my Axe 8 here with the Axe Edit, as you can see on the screen there. And uh, the reason it's on the Surface Pro 4 and not on the PC is basically because with it being on the Surface Pro 4 I can then take it to gigs, I can take it to practices and I can take it anywhere I want and that's that's pretty much it, like I say it's a very short video nice and simple um, or oh, also check out my lovely Gibson Les Paul clock, <laughs> how awesome is that? Um, yeah, like I say you might have a laptop already so all you're really going to need is something like a Focusrite Scarlet or an M Audio, whatever unit you desire. Um, like I say, nice and cheap, easy, simple, straightforward, uh, and a piece of software, some monitors, or obviously you can use headphones if you've already got headphones. A nice, good set of headphones, and obviously your preferred choice of digital modeler, uh, a Fractal Audio Axe 8 in my in my situation here. So that's it. Nice and straightforward, easy, simple. So hope you enjoyed, hope this helped some of you out there with the questions. Uh, any questions you've got, I will try and answer to help you. And uh, yeah, please subscribe. Hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you later.